Radiation therapy can be generally divided into two categories, brachytherapy and telotherapy. Brachytherapy comes from the Greek root of near or close. In this case, we usually put brachytherapy or radiation pellets near the source of the tumor. And this eradicates the tumor by placing radiation sources near the tumor. The other form of radiation called telotherapy comes from the Greek far. In those cases, we generate radiation externally with the linear accelerator and deliver radiation to the tumor through the body. Brachytherapy is commonly used to treat prostate cancers, cervical cancers, uterine cancers, and sarcomas. Brachytherapy can also be selectively used to treat other malignancies as well. There are two general forms of brachytherapy. You have high-dose brachytherapy and low-dose brachytherapy. In low-dose brachytherapy, often applicators are placed inside the patient and radiation pellets or radioactive materials are placed inside the patient. These are temporarily left in for typically days and then removed. Other forms of low dose rate brachytherapy involve leaving radioactive pellets in for the duration of the patient's life. These pellets typically decay over some time period and inside the patient they're left with inert substances. One common use of low dose brachytherapy is the use of iodine or palladium radioactive pellets in the treatment of prostate cancer. High-dose brachytherapy, on the other hand, is often used to treat GYN cancers, such as cervical cancers and uterine cancers. In these instances, the radioactive source is left in the patient for on the order of minutes. This often requires multiple applications rather than one longer application.